In this video, I introduce a local response normalization in artificial neural networks. Local response normalizations in artificial neural networks process input to activation functions to stabilize model training and reduce overfitting. There exists two types of local response normalizations, namely interchannel local response normalization and intra-channel local response normalization. Inner-channel local response normalization is carried out between channels and his neighbors are distributed in one dimension. Applying a kernel I at a unit X, Y, the normalized activity B is computed by using this formulation, where A and B are activities before and after local response normalization. A is the number of channels and K are for beta N are hyperparameters. K is used to handle exception of zero denominator alpha and beta are local response normalization constants and N is the number of neighbors. For example, if N is two for the corner unit, we use two units to calculate the normalized activity B. Otherwise, we use three units to calculate the normalized activity B. If A is four, we use five units to calculate the normalized activity B. The local response normalization is inspired by lateral inhibition in neurology. Intra-channel local response normalization is performed inside a feature map and his neighbors are distributed in two dimensions in the same feature map. The normalized activity B is computed by using this formulation where W and H are width and height of the feature map respectively. Difference between inter- and intra-channel local response normalizations is a specification of a neighbors. For example, for A is two, for the corner unit, we use four units to calculate the normalized activity B. For the edge unit, we use six units to calculate the normalized activity B. Otherwise, we use nine units to calculate the normalized activity B. For example, if k is 0, a is 2, alpha beta is 1. For the intra-channel local response normalization, we use four units to calculate the normalized activity to be here. For the inner unit, we use nine units to calculate the normalized activity B through this formulation. For more details, please check with these references. Thank you. Bye.